Welcome back students, this is your Chendu Gaud. In today's video, I am going to cover certain important concepts and the questions related to the course operating systems, I mean OS under J into H R16 as well as R8 and regulation for computer science engineering as well as information technology have come up with certain gunshot questions. The first and foremost question I have taken into consideration is from the unit 5. List out the various methods of protection of access control as well as uh, what define a deadlock and four necessary conditions and solution in recovery deadlock is a gunshot question related to deadlock and we're getting one question for sure importance of memory protection in multi-programming systems is also asked several times as well as safe and safe deadlock state process and domains or principles of protection is also very important question and the access algorithm as well as bankers algorithm of which we'll be getting one question from this concept and operational versus external security in operation system and define resource and list out its types we can expect related to deadlock one question dear students or the memory protection as well as access or bankers algorithm from this part you are going to get 15 15 mark question i mean 8a as well as 8b now let's look at the important concepts of unit one and the very very important and gunshot questions may be from functions objectives or the views of operating system and role of OS as a resource manager and the management system calls of OS from this part you will be taking one question for sure and the properties of time sharing and distributed systems as well as the multi-programmed parallel as well as personal operating system from this part you are going to get 1A as well as 1B dear students please do concentrate all the part and work out accordingly and define the uh, system components and list out them as well as the differences between client server and P2Pair models of this distributed system and bootstrap program and its need as well as internal inter-process communication and computing environment where varieties used in operating system and from this part you can expect to a as well as to b please do work out accordingly all these concepts to score out of out mark i mean 30 marks will be asked from this later the unit 2 is all about the scheduling algorithm and its list and explain the terms for exist weight weight pid and exec as well as the role of a scheduler and its requirements and round robin or scheduling and its algorithm along with the examples and certain problems related to these two concepts that is fcfs they'll be asking you to work out the grand chart are giving you average weight timing please do work out this may be one of the gunshot question and from this part we can expect 3a as well as 3b dear students later define the process synchronization and semaphores is also one of the very important question related to semaphores will be asking in the process synchronization and its advantages and disadvantages too and critical section problem and the example and cpu scheduling algorithm as well as process state diagram and the uh, differences between interbound process as well as cpu bound process from this part you can be getting the 4a as well as 4b please students please do write your exam very neatly to score a good mark and let's look at the unit 3 unit 3 is also very important and note on virtual memory and demand paging and the examples and thrashing and its process and the physical and logical address space and memory allocation technique advantages and its advantages from this part you can expect 5a as well as 5b and explain the differences between paging and segmentation and need of paging replacement and there may be one problem related to this working out a compulsory gunshot question is this for sure a 15 mark direct question find the number of page falls with fifo lru optimal page and free for replacement they'll be asking you to talk and the differences of these two or as well as the replacement with four frame as well as a five frame on a following reference string when a following reference string is given in this fashion like one two three four so on you are supposed to work out this this is one of the gunshot question related to these concepts as well as the internal versus the external fragmentation from this part you will be getting sixth question or sometimes six or six b this may be direct 15 mark question i'm giving you certain important questions only in the fourth unit i mean the seventh question is all about the disk scheduling and its algorithm and seek time versus rotational latency as well as the file system and the various file access methods you can work out these to get a seventh question i have covered all the eight questions from this operating system which benefits you all to work out and please do concentrate on the part which have focus good luck and god bless you all thank you